Hey guys, so, sorry my phone went off, sorry about that. Um, I am doing my New Year's resolution video and I decided to do, to do it near my tree because it's a couple of days after New Year's, I mean it's the 6th, but um, I've had these New Year's resolutions um, in my mind and I just finally put them down on paper and now I'm doing this video for you guys, so it's finally like out there. Um, um, so, yeah, um, this is my Christmas tree. You can only see part of it because it really goes up to, up in my staircase. It's nine feet long. Um, so, I mean, it's a fake Christmas tree anyway. I use this all, we use this every year. I've had this for about nine, ten years. But, um, it goes all the way down. So, that's my Christmas tree. Sorry, let me just tell somebody real quick. I'm doing, that did not come out right. Okay. So, I have six New Year's resolutions. Um, oh, before I get started, if you guys notice I'm wearing my Broncos, I don't know if you guys notice and I have, like, the thing down here a little more. You can see, like, my Bronco. I am a Redskins fan, and if you do, like, I am a Redskins fan or whatever, but Redskins and Cardinals are both out of the playoffs, if you know football. They're out of the playoffs, but the Broncos are still in. The Broncos are still one of my really good teams, and I really like them. So, I'm wearing my Broncos jacket today, and, um... Some leggings, so if they win um, this weekend because they had their they had the first bye week off for the playoffs, uh, first playoffs bye week or whatever, them and a bunch of other teams did. Uh, so if they win against the Chargers, hopefully they will, and I know they will because the Broncos are amazing. They're gonna crush the Chargers, and I will wear this outfit again next Monday. So a lot of people are gonna be excited about that, um, because. I was being sarcastic because a lot of people don't like the Broncos and they think I'm just a bandwagon with the Broncos and you know they can think what they want but I know my teams and I know what I'm true to so yeah um okay let me get started that was enough rambling for this video um and I do want to say that I'm going to be doing a video shortly after this uh so I will be in the same spot so yeah and I do. I'm doing two in one day because I'm trying to get more out because I do have homework and stuff even though it was the first day back for school for me because we had a two-week winter break, which was so nice. And we might not have school tomorrow, so I might do another video because the high for tomorrow is 19 degrees. The low is 3. Where I live, it gets really cold. I wish I lived in Arizona again. Okay, moving on. Um, I just have them written down on a piece of paper, and it's kind of hard to read my handwriting because... Um, the pen that I was using is kind of bad. It's a nice pen, but it just, like, scribbles my words out. So, yeah. Okay, so the first one is I'm going to try and keep my room clean as much as possible this year because my room is so dirty. That's why I decided to film down here also because I can't really move in my room besides my bed, and that's a really weird place to do my videos. So I really have to re keep my room clean. I cleaned it a little bit yesterday, but I, it's just all, like, my bed stuff that I don't sleep with is on my floor, and that's what kind of messes me up. But it was all, like, Christmas stuff that I had on my floor, so I had to just clean that up and then clean a couple more things. Like, my desk is really bad, and I'll be able to start filming back on my desk. I did for a couple days um, until it got messed up again. Um, so, so excited to keep this goal. If I keep it, I'm going to be so proud of myself because I've said that for the past, like, seven years, and I've never done it. I'm so bad at keeping my room clean. Like, I just, I can't do it. I can barely keep it clean for a week. That's really bad, but I have a really bad problem with that. So that's, what I, that's one of my goals that I'm really, really trying to stay true to this year. Um, so, yeah, if I keep that, I'm going to be so proud of myself. So, yeah. Um, number two is I have to exercise more. Yeah, I do soccer, but that's more in the spring and the fall. And then after that, more like, when, when soccer's over, when soccer season's over, I just kind of, I don't know, sit around and, like, I don't really do much. I don't really go out running, and I need to start doing that because <coughs> I need to just keep myself in shape for soccer. I need to keep in shape all year round because um, it's just bad for me, and I I just need to get help. I just need to um, exercise more for myself, really not for anybody else, but I don't like how I I don't like my body figure or whatever. And my sister is really, really, really skinny, but that's from my mom's side. My mom's, my mom's side is really, really, they have a slim figure, but my sister eats, like, all the time, but she just never gains any weight. But, um, that's not how I am. I'm more my dad, so my dad's side is, we, we, when we eat, we gain weight. Um, 
So I'm really just trying to work out and just try and get myself back into shape. And also, soccer really does help with that. Um, you know, running around on the field. I mean, you run like two miles in a game, two, three miles in a game. And then you have practice whenever, like I practice two to three times a week. And um, I'm not doing my high school soccer team, which is going to affect me even more because I was going to do two leagues, which is going to make me run and work harder even more. But I'm not doing that this season because I think that would be just too much for my freshman year. So I'm going to do it my sophomore year, and I'm going to do my other league. So I'm going to have, like, no free time, but I'm going to be staying in shape. So that's a plus for me. Number three is I want I have to eat healthier because, I mean, I if you look at my desk, I have two boxes of candy canes that I bought after Christmas, and I have a bunch of sweet tarts, and I just have all this candy around me. And I'm not eating as healthy as I should. I eat chips, and I, I really don't eat, like, fruits and vegetables like I need to. I eat the fruits that I like when I have them. I eat the vegetables that I like when I have them. Not all the time. Like, I won't, eat, I won't always eat, like, the vegetables that we have at our house. But I try, I try sometimes. But I just need to really start eating healthier. Like, I need to start telling my mom, okay, you, I, like, I need to eat healthier. I need you to get this. I don't think having a burger last night really helped. But, I, but it wasn't like I, did, I didn't eat it all. So I need to, like, cut out, like, burgers and stuff like that. More, like, one, twice a week. And Chipotle. Oh, I need to cut that a lot. And that's depressing. Uh. <laughs> and I need to cut um, Starbucks as much. This is actually getting depressing because I love Starbucks. Um, the fourth one is I need to try harder at school with, like, my grades and stuff because I really don't care about my grades right now, and that's going to affect me in the long run because the college that I want to get into, yeah, I'm a freshman, and I know what college I want to go to. I know what two colleges, two, three colleges that I want to go to. But the colleges that I want to go to, you have to have, like, better grades than I do. And I know it's, I don't know if it's your freshman year, but they do look at all of your um, grades. And it does, like, um, count into your GPA. And I don't want that affecting me in the long run. I don't want to be, like, I don't want to, like, slack off my freshman year and then do great my sophomore, junior, senior year, but my GPA isn't as high because of my freshman year. And I want to go to Arizona State. I don't know the GPA for that, or if I don't get into Arizona State, I'm also going to try for um, U of A, which is um, about three miles from ASU, or three hours from ASU. Um, though it's still in Arizona, it's a college. Of, I want to go to a college in Arizona, but I also do want to go to a West, Virgi um, West Virginia University. Um, cause they, have the really, they have a really good athletic training program, and that's what I want to do for um, my future. I do want to be an athletic trainer for an NFL football team, which would be amazing. Um, so I need to keep my grades up, and I need to try harder at school because I had extra credit stuff that I could have turned in today, but that I just didn't do over break because I was too lazy. And then <clears throat> I had something that was due the day before break, and I didn't do it. And then if we turned it in tomorrow, we get half credit for it or whatever. I don't know how to write a paragraph in Spanish. I don't listen in Spanish. My teacher just gives me grades. She just gives me good grades because she likes me. That's bad. I need to try. Okay, next one. This is more for, like, me. Uh, I need to, I'm going to try and look more presentable to, like, school and out in public because I really, I just throw on something. And I don't even care about my hair and my makeup. And, yeah, people say that I, I don't need makeup or my hair to be done because my hair, this is my hair, like, natural. I just step on it and then put it in a pony. And, yeah, it's basically straight, but I want it, like, straighter for me. And I want to do my makeup for me. But the outfit that I wore was actually pretty presentable today, um, considering I woke up, like, 20 minutes before I leave. But, like, I, I have, like, this sweater on, which is really nice. It's the yoga that I was wearing, and then, oops. Uggs, whatever. Okay, and then the sixth one is I need to be nicer to people. I'm mean at my school. I'm not like mean, 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 like I'm like the person that nobody wants to talk to or whatever. I'm just meaner to people that I don't like. Like in the mornings, there's no me being nice. Like this one girl came up to me, don't even want to repeat what she said, but she like got this close to me. It was 7 o'clock in the morning. I don't like people at that time. I have my friend and my other friend. 
they don't get along. So I hang out with my best friend because my best friend, my other friend is my best friend's ex-boyfriend. So, I mean, they're friends, but I need to be nicer to people. Those are like the really, I have like three, four people that I've really talked to at school. But I rather have, I'm just saying that you, I rather have <coughs> four um, quarters than a hundred pennies. And it's, like, I'd rather have four really, really, really close friends that I know I can trust forever than a hundred fake friends that I know I can't trust. So I'd rather have the four people that I really talk to at school and then not have as many friends. I mean, I don't really care. I really don't. Don't like school. Really don't feel like going. Sorry, that was really annoying me. So, you know, I just need to be nicer to people so I can have... I saw I'm not having those... 100 pennies, though. So I'm still having, like, this couple of really good friends I know. Like, people try and talk to me, and I'm just like, uh, walk away. And I told, like, this, uh, junior to, like, screw off. Like, he talked to me. I was talking to my sister's boyfriend. And he, there's a joke between us. And then he was like, are you okay? And I was just so mad that day that I was like, screw off. And then he was like, hey, don't tell me. And then he like started yelling at me and I was walking down the hall like, I really don't care what you have to say. Like, um, no. Don't talk to me. I'm talking to Jordan. Jordan, yeah, his name's Jordan. I'm talking to Jordan, my sister's boyfriend. Yeah, I understand you're on the football team with him. And yeah, I understand that you guys are friends. But I don't know you. I don't talk to you. See, there's my problem. <laughs> That's exactly my problem. Wow, I mean, turning into my older sister. That needs to change. Okay, so that's my New Year's resolution, guys. I really hope I can keep them, and I want to see if you guys have your New Year's resolutions. Um, leave, let me know down below what your New Year's resolutions are, New Year's resolutions are, and um, tell me why. So yeah, that's mine. Hope you guys enjoy. Bye.